crazy meal. Uh, everybody wants their story told, you know? That's the one human thing we all share. That's what we all leave behind. Everybody wants it. And I am lucky enough to have my story told by Neil in one of the most powerful art forms there is, the movies. You know, it's the quickest way in the heart is watching a movie. And I feel very lucky about that. So thank you, Neil. And thank you, Oklahoma City. And thank you, me, Pond. <laughs>
community of other people raising their kids around us that was like, you're not really seriously doing this, are you? Like, really? You're artist? You're not really going to make a living doing that, right? I mean, you've got to come back down to earth and have shitty jobs like the rest of us. <laughs>
fry to a crackly crunch from doing that. And, uh, but I, my next one, would, I would love the next one to be right here in Oklahoma City. And it's a very big possibility. <laughs> But uh, my parents owned a toy store for 25 years, and uh, your art, especially in Pee Wee Herman's Playhouse, was a huge inspiration for my father, who built a lot of what went into the store. So cool. I'm really, so the DVDs are for sale because I don't really want to get him one. As so, children of the 80s, we think. Yeah. You're welcome. <laughs> You're very welcome. Nice. Is he going to be over here? Yes, we'll be making, uh, find us on Facebook. We'll be making announcements cool. very soon. Thank you. I have a question for Neil. Yeah. Um, did the project turn out the way you thought it would originally, and what did you learn as as uh, as the process went through? What was the big take home? The, the biggest takeaway for me was uh, well, it, it, it turned out people like it. That's what I hope all along. Um, and, it, and it's funny and inspiring. Those were my two goals. We'll make it make. I want it to be very very funny, and I hope it was. And I want it to be inspiring. I want it to motivate people to go and do something because that's why I made the movie, because he inspires me. So in that respect, yes. I mean, it did take twists and turns in the editorial process, but the biggest thing I learned was to trust people. This is my first movie, and to just learn to trust an audience and to trust people that work for you and to trust the process, just to let, let go of any inhibitions or any issues you have, just to just trust that this will work if you, if you, you know, we screened it, and I trusted people that they gave good feedback because they wanted it to be good. So that was the big takeaway for me was just, Keep my head out of it and trust people. One more, one more question. I say bravo. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Woo! Thank you very much.